So I got asked to make a video about how to boot Android 9, Android TV from a USB stick um, on the Raspberry Pi 4. So this is what I'm going to be showing in this video. So first, you need to go to Consta King's website and you need, you need to download it. Um, the download link is right here. Just click on it and download it. Then um, with Bolena Etcher, flash it to your USB stick, SSD, HDD, whatever you're going to be using. Just flash it. And once that's done, we have to do some um, special steps for it to boot from USB. So you have to have a, your updated EEPROM. So I have another video uh, that shows how to um, update your EEPROM for USB boot. So if you haven't done that, you should do that. And then um, he has a little tutorial right here he shows. How to boot from a USB device. So, right here it says, um, so I'm so you need to open up your file explorer and go and find your USB stick right here. Mine's local disk F. Um, then you look. Uh, so we got to do what it says. So it so the original name is ramdisk dot image. So let's look for that right here ramdisk.image so it says change that to ramdisk sd card.image so i'm going to copy that then right here i'm going to right click rename and i'm going to paste it and hit enter and then it says ramdisk usb.image we need to change that to ramdisk.image so, where is that? RAM disk USB, right? Yep, RAM disk USB. So, we're going to go here, right click, rename, paste that in there, hit enter. And then the ne next one is RAM disk recovery dot image. So, let's look for that one. Right here, RAM disk recovery. We need to change that to RAM disk recovery SD card dot image. So if I understand right, we're doing this to make the system think that this is like a SD card. So rename, enter. The last one, ramdisk recovery USB dot image. We need to change to ramdisk recovery dot image. So just right click again, rename. Paste it, enter. Okay, so once you do all of those, you should um, plug it into your Raspberry Pi and boot it up, and it should work. And also, before we do that, this is a fresh install, so I need to install um, uh, Google Play. So you need another USB stick for this. So on a different USB stick, uh, click ARM, Android 9, TV stock, download it. Hit download button. Wait for it to download. And then save it to your USB stick. See, this is mine. Okay. And then you just need to wait for that to finish. And boot up Still your the Pi. first boot of how it's going to work. You should see this screen right here. And it should, say, it should say that. And it should boot up. And it should work. Okay, so I booted up and I'm running from a USB stick. So you just accept all of the all of these things. Just do your language, date and time, and then set up your. Okay, Wi -Fi. so I finished setting up, and as you see, um, we really don't have anything in here. So we want to install Google Play um, on our Android TV running off a USB stick so we can install apps. So to do that, we just go over to settings and then we go to um, device preferences, then about, then go down, click click on build a few times and it, until it says you have enabled development settings. And once that's done, just press escape to go back. Or 
Okay, so after that, after you go out of there, just go to developer options. And right here, root access, click on it. Apps and ADB. You need to click the last one. Click OK. Then uh, go back. Uh, actually, don't go back. And then go uh, local terminal. Enable that. And once you done, once you did all of those, go back. Go down to right here to apps. Click on apps. And you see a terminal here. Click on terminal. Okay, so after that, after you go out of there, just go to developer options. And right here, root access, click on it. Apps and ADB. You need to click the last one. Click OK. Then uh, go back. Uh, actually, don't go back. And then go uh, local terminal, enable that. And once you done, once you did all of those, go back, go down to right here to apps, click on apps, and you see a terminal here. Click on terminal, and click allow, and type RPI four dash recovery dot sh. As you see right there, hit enter and click reboot and hit enter. Okay, so now when you open the terminal, type su, hit enter and wait for this, click allow. Then type rpi4 dash recovery. dot s h as you see right here hit enter then type reboot and we're gonna reboot into recovery so we can install google play so then you just go accept the terms of service yes yes Okay, so now you see, we got Android TV running off a USB stick on our Raspberry Pi 4. It's pretty cool. So we can just go to apps right here. As you see, we got all the Google Play apps. We got YouTube, we got Google Play movies and TV, games, music, and they all work. I can confirm that. Yeah, so this is how to install Google, Google. I mean Android TV on a USB stick on your Raspberry Pi 4 with Google Play. So I hope you like this video. I hope you found it. I hope you found it helpful, and I hope you like my video, and I hope you subscribe.